Hey guys, today I'm going to show you a wicked tutorial on how to install your trunk lip spoiler. You're going to need common tools such as a heat gun, a temperature sensor, isopropyl alcohol, soap and water, masking tape, and of course some microfiber cloth. So let's get this started. Currently this is how my Genesis looks like without the spoiler. It's already mean, but it doesn't hurt to be a little more aggressive. The spoiler that I purchased on eBay already contains the OEM color, so I don't have to do any extra paint job to it. All I have to do is just peel off the tape and stick it right on. Alright, the first step we're going to do is going to take a microfiber cloth and just wipe off all the dust, just in the area where we're installing. So Our next step, we're going to take a different microfiber cloth, our soap and water, and spray down the area. All this is doing is degreasing the wax and any oil to not allow our 3M tape to stick properly. Alright, so now we're going to take our isopropyl alcohol, put some on a clean side of our microfiber cloth that we just used and we're just going to wipe the area that it's going to stick at just like this, perfect. This will disinfect the surface to allow you to also stick much better when you apply your 3M double sided tape. Good. Alright, so for this step, we're going to take a heat gun and a temperature monitor. We're going to apply the heat all over the red stripping, that's where our tape is, while measuring the temperature. We want to get between, I would say, 50 to 65 degrees Celsius. That is the most ideal. This will take a bit of time, I'd say five minutes. While you're heating, you can see the red laser, and you can see the temperature. Currently it shows 38, 40 degrees. This is good, perfect. You can also see the tape wrinkling a little bit. That's exactly what you want. And we just apply this heat in a uniform fashion until we get the right heat. The last thing you want while you're driving on the highway when you're 200 is to have the spoiler flying right off. Then you get into the liability issues. Just gonna point it until gets over 50. That's perfect. Okay, so peel these all off. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Now, you're going to carefully I do mean carefully Line it up. Once we get that and we push it down. Boom, 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 boom. It's best for the night time to leave in a warm place so nothing falls off. Lastly, you want to take the heat gun and put it at a very low temperature, 25 degrees, and just heat up on the inside. Be sure not to put it for too long or direct contact, otherwise it's going to burn off the paint. Just like that. Perfect. Take a look at our finished product. This is a beautiful work of art. If you enjoy what you see and like my work, please subscribe and share this video with your friends. And until next time, I will have another tutorial for you waiting.